In the vast, intricate tapestry of health, there exists a protagonist often cast as a villain, cholesterol. This substance, waxy and fat-like in nature, goes beyond being a dietary warning. It forms a critical part of our body structure and plays a pivotal role in the creation of crucial elements like hormones and vitamin D. Yet like a character in a compelling drama, cholesterol has a dual nature. When in balance, it silently upholds our well-being, but excessive amounts in our bloodstream can tip the scales, weaving a tale of potential health complications. Today, we are setting forth on a journey into the chronicles of cholesterol. We'll delve deep into the uncharted territories of this biochemical entity, unravel its intricacies, and most importantly, illuminate the practical and effective ways you can rewrite your cholesterol narrative for a healthier, vibrant life. From dispelling common cholesterol myths to unveiling crucial facts, this exploration aims to empower you with knowledge, helping you reclaim the reins of your health. So let's start this journey together, ready to unveil the truth, navigate the complexities, and regain control of our health story. The role of cholesterol, while often portrayed in a negative light, is a crucial character in our body's biological narrative. This waxy, fat-like substance is a star player in the creation of essential elements like hormones, which orchestrate a multitude of physiological processes, and vitamin D, the sunshine vitamin vital for healthy bones. Furthermore, it has a role in the creation of bile acids, facilitating the digestion process and absorption of fats from our diet. However, cholesterol adopts a Jekyll and Hyde personality in our bodies. In moderation, it's an ally, keeping our body's mechanisms humming smoothly. However, when the cholesterol levels skyrocket, it turns into a menace, leading to the accumulation of plaques in our arteries, a state referred to as atherosclerosis. This nuanced role of cholesterol underpins the importance of maintaining a healthy balance, setting the stage for our deep dive into the world of cholesterol management. The Cholesterol Handbook – Facts You Need to Know Armed with knowledge, we can make informed decisions. And in the context of cholesterol, it's no different. Given that about 74 million U.S. adults have high cholesterol, with less than half getting appropriate treatment, this is a conversation we need to have. The truth is, cholesterol isn't entirely the bad guy. It's a building block for all of our cells and helps our liver process fat. All of our hormones and cells depend on it to function correctly. The issue arises when the levels become exceedingly high. To your surprise, one in every three adults suffers from high cholesterol. Indeed, it's that prevalent. Now, before you point fingers at your eating habits alone, remember, cholesterol levels can also be genetic. Indeed, a significant 75% of cholesterol stems from our genes, whereas a mere 25% is due to our diet. Now, let's talk about foods, specifically misunderstood foods. For example, oatmeal. It's not just a humble breakfast food. It contains soluble fiber that reduces your LDL, the bad cholesterol. Similar benefits can be drawn from almonds and other tree nuts, known to enhance blood cholesterol as well as avocados, packed with monounsaturated fatty acids that can ameliorate LDL cholesterol levels, especially in overweight or obese individuals. Lastly, let's highlight some lifestyle changes that can lower cholesterol. This involves embracing a balanced diet rich in fiber and low in saturated fat, trans fat and cholesterol, shedding excess weight, amplifying physical activity, giving up smoking, and controlling diabetes. Remember, we're united in this journey, and we have the capability to alter our cholesterol story, making one healthy decision at a time. Life with high cholesterol, the before. In our cholesterol narrative, the before chapter often reads like an unwelcome cliffhanger. High cholesterol typically plays a stealthy game, often presenting no obvious symptoms. You might be running daily errands, juggling work-life commitments, or enjoying a weekend hike, all while excessive cholesterol silently accumulates in your arteries. This is the point where the actual risk resides. High cholesterol levels contribute to the development of plaque, a dense, hard sediment that can constrict the arteries, a condition dubbed as atherosclerosis. 
This restricts blood flow, like a highway bottleneck during rush hour, and can lead to coronary artery disease, where the heart's blood supply is blocked or interrupted. The potential complications don't stop there. From stroke, where reduced blood flow can cause part of the brain to be deprived of oxygen, to peripheral artery disease affecting the blood vessels outside the heart and brain, high cholesterol can weave a tale of numerous health challenges. The Role of Genetics in Cholesterol Levels The intricacies of our cholesterol story aren't written by lifestyle factors alone. Genetics also play a leading role in this biological saga. Think of your genes as a unique script passed down through generations, defining your inherent traits, including how your body manages cholesterol. Certain genetic elements can make some individuals more susceptible to high cholesterol. Take familial hypercholesterolemia as an example. It's a genetic disorder typified by elevated cholesterol levels, especially low-density lipoprotein, LDL, often termed bad cholesterol from an early age. Individuals with this condition face an increased risk of early-onset heart disease, highlighting the potent influence of genetics on our cholesterol chronicles. Nonetheless, it's vital to understand that genes do not always have the final say. They may lay out a predisposition, but lifestyle choices have the power to revise this genetic script. Consider it as the distinction between having a route charted out for you and opting to tread on it. Even if your genes have sketched a cholesterol challenge in your story, your actions can still significantly impact the narrative's direction. Misunderstood Foods In the realm of cooking, cholesterol has been portrayed as an antagonist, resulting in a myriad of misunderstandings about specific foods and their impact on cholesterol levels. Some foods have been unfairly blacklisted, while others, quite surprisingly, could be recategorized. Let's unravel some of these misunderstood culinary characters in our cholesterol narrative. Take eggs, for instance, which have long been the subject of cholesterol debates. Indeed, eggs do house dietary cholesterol, but studies suggest that the cholesterol present in eggs influences blood cholesterol levels minimally for the majority of individuals. Then there's shrimp, another dietary villain due to its cholesterol content. Nonetheless, shrimp is also teeming with proteins and beneficial omega-3 fatty acids, presenting a more intricate image than what appears at first glance. Similarly, not all fats are harmful. Although trans fats prevalent in numerous fried and commercially baked goods can escalate your cholesterol levels, beneficial fats like those found in avocados and oily fish can actually assist in regulating your cholesterol. This underlines the fact that in the context of food and cholesterol, delving deeper to comprehend the complete picture is crucial. Life with lower cholesterol. The after. Imagine turning the pages from the before chapter of high cholesterol and entering into an after era, a brighter, healthier landscape where lower cholesterol reigns. This isn't merely a distant possibility, it's an attainable reality that can notably shift your health trajectory. Lowering your cholesterol levels is like clearing out a congested highway in your body, making room for a smooth, unhindered flow of traffic. It curbs the danger of plaque accumulation in your arteries, thereby decreasing the risk of heart disease and stroke. Plus, a drop in cholesterol can result in heightened energy levels, as your heart no longer has to overexert to pump blood through obstructed arteries. It doesn't just boost your immediate wellness, but also paves the way for a healthier future. Consider it as planting seeds for a vibrant health garden that you'll get to enjoy in the years to come. This is the essence of life with lower cholesterol, a refreshing after chapter in your health story that's waiting to be penned. Stress and cholesterol. In the narrative of health, stress is like a rogue character, subtly influencing various aspects, including our cholesterol levels. You see, stress, much like a disruptor in a well-planned plot, can upend the equilibrium in our bodies, impacting the harmony of our cholesterol management. Prolonged stress can have a curious effect on cholesterol levels. It triggers our fight-or-flight response, which, among other things, releases stored fats and sugars into the bloodstream to provide instant energy. This can also result in a surge in cholesterol levels. 
Moreover, how we respond to stress can indirectly affect our cholesterol. Stress might steer us towards less than healthy coping mechanisms, like reaching for comfort foods high in saturated and trans fats, which can contribute to higher cholesterol levels. So managing stress isn't just about mental well-being, it's a crucial chapter in our cholesterol-lowering saga. Intricately woven into the fabric of our daily lives, stress needs a tactical and practical approach for management, creating a conducive environment for healthier cholesterol levels. It's a challenge, yes, but a conquerable one that holds the promise of a healthier after in our cholesterol chronicles. Transition to action. As we navigate the chapters of our cholesterol chronicles, the point of transition from knowledge to action is pivotal. This is the juncture where understanding meets application, where you become the author of your health narrative, dictating the plot twists in your cholesterol levels. Imagine this as the turning point in a captivating novel, the instance when the lead character chooses to confront the obstacles directly. It's about turning a page on high cholesterol and beginning a new chapter defined by healthier habits and informed choices. This shift doesn't necessarily have to be a major leap. It starts with small, consistent steps towards lifestyle changes, like replacing processed snacks with heart-healthy alternatives or swapping the elevator ride with a brisk climb up the stairs. Taking action also involves regular health checkups to monitor your cholesterol levels. Being proactive in scheduling and attending these checkups is like keeping a finger on the pulse of your story, allowing you to detect any plot deviations early and take corrective measures. Embracing this transition phase means you're no longer a passive reader of your cholesterol chronicles. You're actively steering its direction, crafting a healthier after for your tale. Cholesterol in women. In the landscape of health, women face unique terrain. And cholesterol management is no exception to this. As we flip through the pages of the cholesterol narrative, it's essential to shine a spotlight on the distinct challenges women encounter. While women before menopause generally have lower cholesterol levels than men, thanks to the safeguarding effects of estrogen, this scenario changes post-menopause. The decline in estrogen levels after menopause can cause a rise in LDL, the bad cholesterol, and a drop in HDL, the good cholesterol. However, this is not the end of the story. Rather, it's a prompt for proactive steps instead of a frightening diagnosis. It underscores the importance of cholesterol management for women, particularly as they navigate the menopausal transition. A proactive approach to lifestyle modifications, stress management, and regular checkups become even more vital. Understanding this unique chapter of women's cholesterol management equips us better to make informed health decisions. After all, in terms of health, knowledge isn't merely power, it serves as a trigger for constructive change. Practical Steps to Lower Cholesterol now, as we chart the course towards a healthier after in our cholesterol chronicles, it's time to equip ourselves with practical, actionable steps that can turn the tide in our favor. Consider these steps as the directions to your destination, guiding you along the journey to lower cholesterol levels. Embracing a heart-friendly diet forms one of the essential elements of cholesterol control. This involves a colorful palette of fruits and vegetables, lean proteins, whole grains, and healthy fats. It's like shopping for a health-enhancing wardrobe. You want to fill your cart with items that promote good cholesterol and leave those that elevate bad cholesterol on the shelf. Physical activity is another key chapter in our cholesterol-lowering journey. Incorporating habitual exercise into your regimen is akin to infusing fresh air into the body aiding in elevating your HDL or good cholesterol levels while reducing your LDL or bad cholesterol. In addition, saying no to tobacco and moderating alcohol consumption can go a long way in managing cholesterol levels. It's about making informed decisions, creating a narrative that champions health and wellness, and ultimately scripting a rewarding after chapter in your cholesterol journey. Kids and Cholesterol in the vast narrative of cholesterol, it's easy to overlook the smaller characters, our kids. However, it's essential to understand that high cholesterol isn't just an adult plotline, 
It's a story that can affect children, too, making it vital to ensure the chapters of their young lives are also scripted with health in mind. Contrary to common perception, the foundation of heart disease can be laid down during childhood, frequently linked with elevated cholesterol levels. Childhood obesity, sedentary lifestyles, and diets high in processed foods can contribute to higher cholesterol levels in kids, creating a health narrative that's less than ideal. The silver lining here is that childhood is an excellent time to instill healthy habits, effectively writing a plot twist into the cholesterol story. Introducing kids to balanced diets, engaging them in physical activities, and scheduling regular cholesterol checks are like planting health seeds that can bloom beautifully in their adult lives. Emphasizing cholesterol awareness and management in children can help to set the stage for a healthier, happier future, ensuring their cholesterol chronicles start on a positive note. As we come to the end of this chapter in our cholesterol chronicles, it's clear that the narrative is in our hands. We have the power to shape the story, to choose a path that leads towards lower cholesterol and hence a healthier, happier life. The journey may present challenges, but armed with knowledge and the will to implement practical steps, we're equipped to navigate them. Remember, every chapter you add to your health journey is a testament to your resilience and commitment. So don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Join us as we unravel more health mysteries and continue to empower yourself with knowledge. After all, the journey towards better health is one best traveled together. There are plenty of foods you can eat or even change habits to prevent cholesterol. Let's have a look at a couple more videos. Check out 10 life-changing health tips backed by science. Transform your life today. You can also try our video on say goodbye to belly fat forever with these secret techniques. Go ahead, click one, or better yet, watch both, and learn more about how to live healthier.